this is ridiculous and it's almost embarrassing. Welcome back to another vlog. Today is Thursday, February 17th, and today starts February break. So we are out of school today, tomorrow, obviously the weekend, and then Monday also. We don't go back to work and school until Tuesday, and I'm that just makes me so excited. How is my computer just on 10% and it just jumped up to 100 and I literally just plugged it in? I went to the gym this morning, felt really good. Y'all, I'm about to do a lot of work on my computer, so we know that means I have to put my blue light glasses on because if not, lately I've been getting like really bad headaches. Like I said, I went to the gym this morning. I didn't wash my hair. I did detangle it in the shower though, like wet. Um, made breakfast like actual breakfast this morning since i'm home right now i'm getting ready to finish up a slideshow so the group so i don't know if y'all remember like way back in august september october around that time um i started mentoring through this program out here in atlanta like metro atlanta area things just didn't work out with my mentee and i like she just wasn't showing up to the Zoom calls and like I would sit on the Zoom session and really was like a waste of my time. Like, yeah, it was really interesting. So anyway, the director of the program reached out to me last week asking um, if I would facilitate a learning styles um, like course through this organization's life skills class. I said yes, you know, I don't mind. Um, you know, it's a topic that I know enough about in the emails, like, you know, you came across my mind as a highly qualified individual based on your educational background. So I put together a really good presentation. I just need to finish up one thing about it. So that is actually on Saturday morning at 11. It's it's virtual, it's on Zoom. So it's um, scheduled for about an hour and I think I'll get things done. Hang on y'all, getting a FaceTime. I don't really have much planned for today, um, but I do have some fun things planned for the weekend. Well, the rest of the week and the weekend, I'm super excited because I'm on break, so I've got time. Hey y'all, happy Friday. It's Friday, February, I don't know, 18th possibly. 8.50 in the morning. Um, I just got back from the gym. Well, I didn't just get back from the gym. I took a shower and everything already. Dropped Isaiah off at the airport. He has some work in Florida to do, literally just for the day at our university. So he comes back tonight. I wanted to show you guys something because I got some stuff in the mail from Amazon. Turn my TV down. Right now I just have on this bodysuit, waist trainer, and shorts because I'm not leaving the house right yet. Like I said, it's still early. There's a couple things I want to do today, but it's a little bit too early. I purchased, oh, I didn't even know they were the same brand. I purchased a new tripod because mine is janky. Like it's broken. It doesn't go as tall as I would like it to. It's just very janky. And I also bought lights. So here's what they look like. It's a set of two lights. They come with these little color screen things in case you wanted to put like a color filter over the lens. So here it is. And then you would just, it's USB. Of course it extends much higher, but there's two and I'm super excited. And they've got the color lenses. Um, of course I'm going to extend them higher, but that's that. Let me show you the other thing. Let's see the height of this thing. Turn that to lock it. Let's unlock all of these. So we can see how tall this bad boy really goes. Oh, wow. Literally, it's, it's actually taller than me. It's actually taller than me. <laughs> so we definitely don't need it that high, but got glad to know that it could go that high should I need it to. New gadgets, always fun. New recording things, always fun. 
I also got some clothing items from Amazon. Now, I've purchased clothes from Amazon before. I don't think I've showed you guys, but I have. Like, I have a jacket. I have a pair of shoes from Amazon. This time, I wanted to purchase some leggings. Not workout leggings, just like regular, regular, everyday leggings. This is a pack of seven, and the sizes go small, medium, or I think large, extra large. So obviously I got a small medium, seven different colors. Okay, they're super soft. They should fit, they look a little bit wide. So this one has burgundy in it, white. This looks like navy blue, black. Can't tell if this is another, no, this is like a gray or a purplish. Light gray, dark gray. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So we are going to, fingers crossed, and hope that they fit just fine. I'm gonna, I plan to wear one today. But for now, we're just gonna watch a little bit of YouTube, catch up on my favorite YouTubers, and yeah. Very disappointed to say that it is 2.04 and I have not done anything productive. I've literally been sitting on the couch watching YouTube since whenever the last time I talked to y'all was, which was like, I think 10 something this morning. In my defense, it is break. There's no real reason for me to be rushing to do anything. I just made coffee though because like, I was like, I'm sleeping. Like my energy is low. I'm like wasting the day away. I don't wanna do that. So I just made coffee. I did try on the Amazon leggings. Let me show y'all. I do have y'all on my new tripod too. So that's super exciting. So they're not bad. They are very high waisted. I think they're so soft, y'all. Like these leggings are so soft. I think once I like dry them, um, they'll be good. So I will keep them. Once I dry them, they'll be snug. They're not very thick though. So like, I don't know how much wear I'll get out of these right now in the colder months, but they'll be good in the warmer months or those like transitional months. What I want to do today, and I've actually been wanting to do for a couple days, is go through my closet and get some things together to bring to Plato's closet and just like clothes that I no longer wear, no longer need. Because I actually already started a while ago, just things that like I don't wear, I'm not going to wear. So like I have some stuff here already. I'm gonna start by looking on my on my shelves like the things that are hanging and see if there's anything hanging that I know for sure I want to rid myself of y'all don't judge my closet I need to organize these clothes also but like this dress is a perfect example this dress I got from H&M a couple years ago it's a size two it's one of those things that like it fits bigger than a size two but I don't think I wore this at all last school year nor do I see myself wearing it again this school year yeah all right so that was all for things that are hanging this first bin is tops and shorts a lot of this stuff is probably things i'll have to try on which i don't mind doing because i do need to narrow my things down um and we will see what's going to get kept and what can go so like this for example right here is perfect for the season that we're in this like blue type of shirt but also it's february and i have not worn this at all yet this year so this is like something that i would consider to kind of send off this is probably a really good chill at home shirt but like it's never on my mind when i'm chilling at home so that means it can go We'll keep this because I like it and I have worn it a few times. Alright y'all, so that's basically what I'm doing, just going through my bins, seeing what I can get rid of, what I can keep. And when I'm done, I'll come back to y'all and show you how big my piles are. So like right now, right now, here is the going pile and we will see how that ends up when i'm done like the size of that when i'm done but i'm just gonna finish and then yeah i'll come back to y'all when i'm done sorting things out I yeah please tell me that i can't that i won't that i fail that i'll never make it out yeah 
Please tell me all the bad, never good Fill my head full of every single doubt, yeah Please say any negative thoughts I pop off when I hear people say I cannot I get off to the thought of proving everyone wrong I won't stop to the top, so you better back off I get lost I'ma stay loud, stay proud Never running out, never heading south I'll be spreading out, call it word of mouth Can't put me down, I'll be getting loud You can never doubt, not what I'm about Have your fucking cloud, it be raining out I keep making sound, go another round Bitch, I'm legend bound, can't stop me now You don't wanna fuck with me a slow burn like a disease Just tell me that I can and I'll show you things That you couldn't believe Just tell me that I can Just tell me that I can Just tell me that I can If I can share with you what I've learned about myself in this process It's that, um... I've got a problem. Definitely have a problem. So all three bins have been sorted through. Pants, lounge, uh, bathing suits, workout, dresses uh, in two pieces, and then tops and shorts. So this is so far what we have that we're going to try to get rid of. So it's a mixture of dresses, workout, all types of things. Pants I'm never going to wear. There's even a couple bathing suits over there. So last thing I need to go through... Well, there's actually a couple more things I need to go through. I need to go through the top of this right here and organize it. Because like this, all of this going on looks ridiculous. I've already gone through this. None of this is going. And then I will just need to go through some of like my workout stuff in my drawers. The things in my drawers typically are not going to go because I typically wear them on a daily basis. I will just need to go through those things on top. And then I'm going to go through the last... Um, the second drawer of workout stuff, like old workout stuff that I'm not wearing currently in the gym. Lay. There's this is ridiculous and it's almost embarrassing to walk into Plato's closet like this, but we're gonna do it anyway. The final tally ended up being three full duffel bags. This one is all closed, this one is all closed, and this one isn't as full. Um, it's closed, whatever little bit of clothes was left, and shoes. So I'm going to head out. I just threw this hat on. I'm gonna keep on these leggings and this um, bodysuit up there. Organized, gotten rid of some things, put some things into these bins down here, put some shoes up there, so now I have more walking space, and I'm satisfied. This is how she's looking just gonna throw the jacket on i'm gonna put it in the car actually i'm not gonna put it on no i am gonna put it on these boots that don't i don't feel like they actually match um yeah i'll see y'all in the car yeah i'm low-key high-key sweating it's actually like warm out here i don't know if it's warm or i just have layers on but it's not it's not 62 that's for sure but it's not cold. Anyway, I'm trying to think of like the order I want to do this. I need to go to Plato's gas station and the post office. I'm thinking that we will go to Plato's, drop this stuff off so they can start. It's going to take them a minute. They already take forever to do the stuff. And then the gas station is right across the street from that. And then I can go to the post office. Hopefully by the time I'm done getting gas and at the post office, then the items will be done at Plato's. But also, y'all, when I walked outside in my apartment, somebody has one of those, like, pods moving in storage things parked outside. And hopefully, somebody is moving out. Fingers crossed. It's either the people above me or the people across from me. Because the people above me, they're very inconsiderate with their footsteps and what they allow their toddler to do. Or, hopefully, it's the person across from me because they have a big dog, a big German Shepherd. And every time I leave the house... I'm like terrified to walk out because I don't want them to be coming out the same time as me because that dog is absolutely terrifying. Two moments later. So apparently my items are ready at Plato's Closet, which makes me not so hopeful that they took majority of the things because I feel like that was really fast. Is Isaiah's plane gets in at 7.30. So that gives me enough time to go home and cook these little chicken tenderloins because I really don't want to buy any food out when I have food at the house and I took out the chicken tenderloins specifically to thaw out and be able to eat today. So I'm going to go pick up my stuff at Plato's and then we'll go home, make something, and then by that time it'll probably be time for us to go get him from the airport. It's giving bossy. Y'all know that Lotta song? I don't even think, did it even get released? I know she has some issues because somebody was saying 
she took the, the song. But it's given vow to be. It's given. It's given. That's the only part I know. Here's my dinner. What time is it? It's 532. So perfect. String beans. Um, barbecue chicken and the cheddar broccoli noodles thing and everything after I calculated everything it came out to 473 calories for dinner so not too shabby I'm really not mad at it y'all yeah I know y'all hear what's going on above me that's why I'm saying if somebody's moving out I really hope it's the people upstairs because it's they're ridiculous 5 30 now isaiah's plan plane lands at 7 30 so after i eat honestly i'll probably hit the road because it is friday night and there may be traffic trying to get to the airport i don't want to run into that so i'm just watching youtube and yeah i'm actually watching it's called all american cast rewatches the show's best scenes i have it paused right now it's from september 1st 2020 it's like a year and a half old but I've never seen it before and it's actually pretty interesting because I love all American y'all I love all American and if you love it too then you know that they took like a hiatus like it feels like forever but y'all it comes back on Monday today's Friday comes back on Monday along with all American homecoming and your girl is overly excited so I've been like binging all of like the behind the scenes like extra little fun all American things because I cannot wait for Monday so I'm just gonna finish watching this eat and then I'll be on my merry way today is leg day I love leg day I have no idea why people tend to skip leg day don't like leg day I don't get it because leg day is literally my favorite I feel like my body works a little bit more on leg day and we love that today is going to be a pretty busy day after the gym so i don't even know what time it is um, do i ever know what do i ever know what time it is let's honestly be real here 7 47 after the gym i have like an hour and a half to get my life together because i have a presentation to give at 11. i'm not nervous i guess because it's a topic that i know like inside out we'll see because like with me i tend to get nervous right before like i tend like i know this is kind of like right before because it's in a couple hours no i mean i tend to get nervous like the seconds before i have to do something but we're just gonna say I'm not nervous. After that, one of my friends from college, y'all have never, never met her, but you will today. As long as she's okay with being on the vlog, I don't see why not. And we are going to a concert tonight. We're going to Summer Walker is on tour, so we're gonna go there. Also, and this is a really big also, we have another special guest in town. And I'm not gonna tell y'all who it is. I'm just gonna let y'all see this person so okay let's go to the gym because like i said it is leg day and leg day is my favorite i honestly don't know how people like skipping leg day i think abs and core are second runner up but arms is definitely last like arms is like bottom of the barrel okay y'all it is 10 47 which means that i have 13 minutes until this learning styles presentation. Yourself and with your social interactions as well, I think this is always a helpful uh, topic in multiple settings. So um, I will hand the, the floor over to Tiana to, um, to teach us about learning styles. Yes, thank you so much for having me. Good morning, ladies. Um, so I should be able to share my screen, correct? I should have that capability. All right. Does that look good? Can can we all see that? Perfect. All right. So good morning. Good. Good morning. Thank you guys so much for having me today. Um, when I saw this topic, I was like, yes, because it's so important that everybody knows how they learn, um, you know, to best move forward in whatever part of life that you are in. So, um, yes, I teach third grade and, and this is my third year teaching third grade. I don't see it changing anytime soon because I absolutely love it. So yeah, so we're going to dive in. There's plenty of different learning styles that we are going to learn 
learn about today. Um, you girls will even have a chance to kind of dive in and see what your learning style is more if you do not already know. So let's just go ahead and get started. So first thing is, if you're not familiar, what is a learning style? Basically, it's just how you learn. So what works best for you? Um, it could be that you learn better just by hearing like a lecture. It could be that you learn better by reading notes or reading a book or rewriting notes. It could be that you learn better by actually doing the action instead of maybe reading instructions first. Uh, so there are eight total learning styles. There's four main learning styles, so we're going to focus mostly on those first. Um, but with, you know, the older you get, you want to know about all eight because it kind of just narrows it down particularly. Um, and so, you know, for what suits you best. So... Hey y'all, my presentation is over. It went really, really well. I was nervous though because everybody had their camera off except for the director of the, the mentoring program. So like, I couldn't really read their faces because I couldn't see their faces, obviously. But I think it went really well. They were really receptive, um, like in the chat box. Like, I think it went well. My camera died in the middle of it, or like literally right at the beginning, so I don't know how much footage I got, but I tried turning it back on and just exhausting the battery as best as I could, and I think I got some good enough stuff, but it was actually really good. Like, I think it went well. They said they enjoyed it. They learned about themselves. They didn't realize there were so many learning styles. Grand total, we burned 652 calories today on a leg day which is my favorite day. I don't know how people don't like leg day only thing I've consumed today is my vitamins and I'm drinking a slim fast shake because I didn't I knew I didn't have time to cook anything y'all I was sweating so bad during that meeting these sweat marks are like drying up but it was so bad let me call my other friend and see what she's doing attention to look who it is it's me and hey I told y'all y'all would be shocked by who surprise. it is. Because this is twice in three months. What is she talking? Y'all, she talked and so I've much noise here. about me the last time. I've lived here no. for two and a half years. Y'all. And this is her second time coming. But I'm here. You're That's here. What That's all that matters. <laughs> but yeah, y'all, we're in the mall. See, it's embarrassing. Because people be Nobody, looking at But nobody's paying attention. Nobody's paying attention. In my mind. Yeah, <laughs> people. Right yeah we're going to go out that door. Right there. Anyway. Um, we're at Perimeter Mall because Got us a little she needs to really yeah, me, don't honestly. need, I don't know what I'm wearing to brunch tomorrow, but I found two Still shirts, two shirts for $5 at Forever, and I have a couple pant options, so we'll see, but we're getting ready to head out and go to Wish, because I need a ponytail. Go get my good sister's little ponytail. I want a pony ponytail. I want a ponytail for tonight, possibly, hopefully, we'll see. A few moments later. Look alive, look alive, niggas came up on this side, now they on the other side. Oh well, fuck them dog, we gon' see how hard they ride. I get racks to go outside, and I spit it with the guys. We up on the other side, niggas actin' like we tied. I been gone since like July, niggas actin' like I died. They won't be expecting shit when Capo go to slide, cause I told them that we put that shit. What's up, baby? You take me out to dinner. Here we come, Summer Walker. We are. Yo, meet Day Day. Ah, Y'all have no. never met Day Day. No. We go way back. Way back, like Cat And she's making her appearance. We're late. It is 8.32. Okay, Summer's waiting on us at this point. <laughs> Apparently the concert started 32 minutes ago. But who really knows? My camera quality has gotten so better between yesterday and today. I don't know what I did different. Y'all like my ponytail? Y'all yeah. know I'm the queen of a, of a poppin' ponytail. Had to bring it back. $20. $20. Can't beat it. Yeah, y'all, here's the outfit for the night. Just a black turtleneck, flare jeans, black booties, and a black jacket. And it's gonna have to be. Take me as I am. Ew, I'm looking ashy. Didn't you just put lotion on? Y'all look at Day Day's jeans. Look at how cute these are. They have little rhinestones on the booty cheek. 
and get into the Ooh, get into, get into it, get into it. Look at the belt. Look at the belt. Ice me out. Ice me out. Ooh, look at the shades. Let me find out. No plan. Very cute. Love it. Yeah, y'all. I'm gonna hopefully they'll let me take my camera in. If not, I mean it's coming in anyway. There should be no issues. I might just take the tripod stand off. But yeah. We'll see you when we get there. Yo, we're here. As expected, they I can't bring my um camera in. Then they get her pictures taken. I can't bring my camera in, so we're gonna be vlogging off the phone. Back to the OG days. It is what it is. This lighting is so good. Hey, hey. Okay, y'all know my lighting is all messed up because I thought I was a camera person before. <laughs> but it's giving. It's giving. It's like giving. back up a little bit. It's giving it's exactly giving. what they said it was it's gonna give. Giving. Exactly what I said it yeah, was gonna my, give. My did. She was like, "You gotta make sure you tie this part up." And I came on time and she fixed me. I put a fedora Happy on. Sunday. I was inspired by Day Day's so cousin good. yesterday to wear a fedora. Because so I gotta tell you about the day ponytail. Yeah, you need to tell me. Hey y'all, last week y'all probably can't even hear me. Brian's Sweet Fruit Lounge. It was yes, lit. It was lit. Definitely fun. A vibe. I think this is my first time sitting in the like day party side. And it was lit. And it was definitely fun. I wouldn't say it was like two turn. It yeah, was like. It wasn't like out of the seat. Yeah. Like, it was a lot of. He, he's about to park oh, here. I almost was. Right. Me too. It's, <laughs> it was a lot of older people in there at the time. Um, not like old, but older. Like 40, 30, right. 40s. Like 30s, 40s. Wait, hold on. I'm only a couple years away from 30. What you trying to say? I'm old. <laughs> 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 
But yeah, I mean, it was good. The DJ was good. I give it up to the DJ. And our waitress was bomb. She was like, it was free. We, oh, sorry. They got chicken and waffles. I got just chicken and um, fries. And she came over out of nowhere and she was like, it's going to be a little minute for the chicken. <laughs> We're having issues with the chicken. Yo, I think they went to the farm killed the chickens and brought them back that's yeah, my theory the, the but she was cooking no for real no that chicken was good yeah, i mean that good. chicken was nice and hot and everything mm -hmm. but she um she was like i can just give y'all drinks bottomless. she didn't even say bottomless did I she, say bottomless. Oh, she, oh, like, she did bottomless. oh i didn't hear her say bottomless i guess that's why i was so shocked that she kept on refilling it because yeah. i didn't hear her say bottomless like, i'm gonna just give y'all bottomless mugs, okay Girl, y'all, she kept refilling it, like taking it away, refilling it, come back, refill it, make sure it was topped off, y'all. I'm like, she this is the energy we us. need. <laughs> this is definitely the energy that we need. But we about to head back to my house now because Key, it's time for her to go home. Now it's time for you the know, departure. a series of unfortunate events that we're just not going <laughs> to talk, talk about. about. We're just not going to keep the positive energy. Yeah, positive we're just going to, yes, exactly. And I am going to book it to the gym because Isaiah has a game at five. I told him I might be a little bit late. That's okay. You're going to the gym? I was going to the gym. No, not the gym. Oh. I'm going to the, like, the I mean, basketball. I thought you were going to the gym before, 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 before you go to the game. What? No, I would die. I would <laughs> die. I'm sorry. I would die. What's no, he had a game at two, and if they won, they play at five. If they if they win the game at five, they play you, at seven. Are, you, are they okay? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. I think he took this stop for pedestrians a little bit too seriously. Because ain't no pedestrians around. Yeah, we out here. I never get to show y'all Atlanta in the daytime. We're out here by, I think, Georgia State. Yeah. Sitting in, I don't know, traffic for what. But y'all, it's so nice out. Like It's a nice day. Sun is out. It ended up, it's yeah, it's like cool. 60 degrees. Yeah. I think because I have long tip. sleeves on and stuff, I feel very comfortable. Oh, now there's See, I got me all in the... In the Sorry. <laughs> don't let up off the brake. <laughs> Whatever you do, don't let the brake. Whatever you do, stay on the brakes. <laughs> Do you think he, he can see me? Probably. Yeah, he can see me. This thing got no sense. This is fishbowl. Fishbowl. Fish 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 you were taking your picture. Come on, choose your fish. Nah, it's not safe for you. I'm going to the game just like this. Because what? All time to say It's over. And I feel so alone. This is the sad. All right, let me go because I need to get to the gym. Yeah, I got a minute before the game starts. One minute before the game starts, man. Okay, y'all. Think you can make it? Yeah. Well, I'm not taking off my seatbelt. Where am I going? <laughs> Maybe I'll, I'll, I gotta give you a hug. That's what yeah. I'm yep. Stop and get some, get a sandwich, get some bread from somewhere. <laughs> go to racetrack. Get some coffee. You got water? Where are my keys? Oh my god. Thank you for the mask. I really appreciate it. I'm gonna You're use it to pat pat my it face my face. Feet. It was so nice meeting you. I cannot wait till you come back again in the summertime. I'm gonna make Keith stop, stop and get you. <laughs> One more time for the outfit. Oh, oh, hey, let these hoes know. Twerk on these hoes. Hey, hey. Can you get me right quick? Yes, I got you. I got you. Ow. Yeah. Oh, got you, got you, got you, girl. What do you say? The summertime abs coming summertime in. Summertime abs is coming Look at in. Okay. Wait, Natch. Waist on. Hey. <laughs> hey, 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 drop it low, girl. Drop it, drop it low, girl. Drop it, drop it low. Ow. <sighs> y'all, what a day. I have, I left my tripod in the car by accident, so y'all are just propped up on my centerpiece on my dining room, on my coffee table. But anyway, it is Monday at 11 o'clock on the dot. And it's President's Day, so out of school. Yesterday, y'all, yesterday was a day. Yesterday was a day. It was definitely um, fun. It started off kind of crazy. We're not even going to get into that. Just know that the lesson learned is I'm not driving any car that is not my own anymore in my life. That's the lesson. They left, and then I had to make it out to Marietta because Isaiah had basketball games. Like, he had two more. And I wanted to try to make it because I couldn't make it to the ones on Saturday because they were later in the day, which that was another event altogether. Before I go, I wanted to tell y'all because I was just 
so happy yesterday we were at brunch we were getting y'all i'm so sorry how i look i it was it's wash day and i just put my hair on this bun yesterday when i was at brunch um and we were getting ready to do the 360 thing or whatever the guy in charge of it was like okay summertime abs i see summertime abs coming through and y'all i literally was so excited i was like you made my day blah 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 because thinking about it like if you're on a weight loss journey a lot of times people will say you know it's always the non-scale victories that can like really inspire you and motivate you to keep going and stuff and that's an example like that man didn't know me from anybody like never seen me before i've never seen him before so we really didn't have anything to like compare me too you know what i'm saying if that makes sense like he's never seen seen me before so he doesn't he doesn't see the progress that i've made if that makes sense but for it to like for it to be noticeable for things like that to be noticeable to a stranger i was so excited y'all so yeah that is really it for this vlog i'm just gonna hang out today um isaiah and i are gonna go get something to eat in a little bit he has to work today so um he's doing that i'm gonna just get some household things done and yeah thank you guys so much for watching i really hope you guys enjoyed this little quick impromptu turn up weekend vlog with me and i will see you guys in my next video see you later for lifers right